Well, Yellowstone National Park will unveil a brand new Old Faithful Visitor Center next Wednesday. It replaces an old center which was built in the 1960s. At that time, there were about a million and a half visitors each year to Yellowstone. Now, of course, that number has doubled. Eyewitness News reporter Stephen Pope was among the first to go inside the new center. He gives us a sneak peek. Four out of every five visitors who go to Yellowstone stop by Old Faithful, making it their biggest attraction. They want to know when the geyser goes off. They want to know what causes it to go off. They want to know what causes all the steam that they see as they drive up to Old Faithful. This new visitor education center is designed to help engage them, inform them, and prompt them to learn a little bit about the park. The new visitor center has a prime piece of real estate. Now, as you follow me in here, you can see the grand view of the Old Faithful Geyser. We really hope that this is going to have an incredible impact on visitors um, to really understand, get a, a really strong science lesson on what is happening um, with the geothermal features. Exhibits in the new visitor center explain that we're on a volcano and it takes heat, it takes water, and it takes fractures to make the Old Faithful Geyser work. This is a model of a geyser. It could be Old Faithful Geyser, but there are hundreds of others in Yellowstone. And it helps people get a sense for what happens underground. There's also a stadium seating theater and a bookstore inside the center. And while no visitors have yet seen the inside, they have plenty of things to say about the exterior. What we've seen, it's a lovely building. It uh, seems to be designed uh, with, a, with an eye to blending into the into the basic ambiance of the area. I like the architecture, I think it's interesting. I like the way the, uh, the uh, peaks mimic the mountains, but it's not exactly like the rest of the architecture around. Crews have less than a week to finish putting polishing touches on the center before it opens to the public. Stephen Pope, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Beautiful new building. The new Old Faithful Visitor Center will be dedicated next Wednesday at 11 a.m. and then will be open to the public for the first time. Well, if you